Hey everybody, welcome to the workshop here in the garage. Uh, kind of multifaceted workshop, storage of clubs, golf balls, golf cart, workout. Um, if you've been watching any of my social, you've seen this spot before. Um, I'm excited today because I just got mailed to me the, the new Pro V1 and Pro V1Xs in the, in the new boxes. I've been an ambassador for Titleist since 1983 when I turned professional. Um, and every year now since 2000, the Pro V1 has come out, every two years actually, the Pro V1's come out new and improved. I was uh, happy in, 19, in 2000 at Vegas in October when the new balls debut uh, to have shot 64 in the first day, the uh, first time I ever used the ball in competition. Um, and it's been kind of neat to see over the years the changes in the boxes. Uh, two generations ago, uh, the last generation here, this is both the Pro V1X uh, box. I've been using the Pro V1X uh, the last couple of years, I need a little bit more launch, and a uh, higher launch angle, need a little bit more spin, uh, and I still feel like it doesn't sacrifice anything around the greens. That's what's been the great spot. Um, earlier in October, um, a bunch of the Titleist uh, PGA Tour staff members were sent the prototype, uh, and we always like to see the white box with the Pro V1 and the Pro V1X. So I've been testing these um, since you know the end of last year, playing with both balls, uh, and I'm going to still stay with the, the X. Uh, I just think that a little bit higher launch angle and spin keeps my ball up in the air and, and is better. So the new box arrived today. And whenever we get something that comes from the Akushnet, uh, the Akushnet the headquarters are there in Akushnet, Massachusetts, and the Akushnet River is where they used to bring up the old Balata. Uh, but here is the debut of the two new boxes. Look at that. Uh, fantastic to see. I don't know, it looks fast just sitting there in the box, doesn't it? There's the Pro V1X. There's last year's model, so big difference there in marketing and packaging. And I know everybody in the Titleist family spends a lot of time doing this because uh, you want to have some shelf appeal uh, as well. I just look at this Pro V1 box. Uh, really cool with the coloring. Um, Titleist, as you know, has been black, white, and red in there. Uh, products forever, whether it's in the shag bag or the staff bags. But um, what's interesting to see now, when you look up, there's a, a, a different side stamp, and every time you pull out a sleeve of Titleist, um, it just feels it feels right. Here you go. Here's the new Pro V1 X, and there's the side stamp. And and I'll just let you see the difference. This is last year's ball, so you can see how the arrows have changed a little bit. Uh, a little bit longer and it's always easier for me to line up a line that's a little bit longer I like the little arrow tip right there if you want to use that to to go down the line to when you you know put it on a tee to hit it down the fairway or we, I like to use it when I putt this is really going to help me I might not even have to draw a sharpie line here so that's the new Pro V1 X the new packaging uh, it's starting January 27th both the Pro V1X and the Pro V1 will be available in uh, the PGA Pro Shop near you. So I'd get greedy, buy a box of each and, and try them out. Exciting stuff for the debut again of the new generation of Pro V1 and Pro V1X.